This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. Listen, the bad actors, naked shooting, AMC, are not going to stop. They're not going to stop until they run out of money or until a judge orders them to turn over that trade in history because they they think they own the SEC, the DOJ, and the FBI, and they believe they can do whatever they want with no real consequences as long as they limit their victims to retail investors, pension funds, and institutions that follow the rules. I've never seen anything like this. You have hardly anybody selling, but they're able to push the price of AMC down every single day. It's absolutely crazy. It has nothing to do with supply and demand. It has nothing to do with fundamental. It is just straight criminality. And everybody sees it because if we can see the criminality in the data, and this is the data that they control, even in the data they control, you can see the criminality. So imagine how bad it really is. Okay? Imagine how bad it really is. Anyway, here, here are the numbers for, for AMC. Um, the volume, 5,095,198. You know those numbers mean absolutely nothing because we can't really see what's going on in the dog pools or the other exchanges that they're using to manipulate the price of the stock. Calls in the money, 3,302 at five thousand additional thirty thousand nine hundred and fifteen these numbers also mean absolutely nothing because they can just continue lending the same shares over and over and over again the dtcc is fully aware FINRA's fully aware sec is fully aware doj is fully aware fbi is fully aware and they do absolutely nothing there will be no gamma squeeze the only way to squeeze is, is when they run out of money or the courts order them order them to start turning over that trade in history. And then they're gonna try to start cleaning up so they don't so they don't get caught with their hand in the cookie jar. But by then I believe it's gonna be too late for these Rico conspirators. They're claiming 33.7% of that volume was shorted shares. So somehow they found 1,700,000 shares to short into the market yesterday and manipulate the price. Is anybody gonna ask them? where they got those shares from is anybody in any position of authority even concerned of course not and you know why they're not concerned because they know if they ask those questions they're going to be required to enforce the rules of the market and they are not allowed to do that because these bad actors own the politicians and the politicians own our regulatory agencies and own our law enforcement agency so indirectly the bad actors own our regulatory agencies and our law enforcement agencies and that's why they're allowed to engage in the biggest financial crime in the history of this planet with no repercussions whatsoever and of course they're claiming they can cover all their amc short positions in 7.07 trading days mathematically impossible I mean, if they could have, they would have got out to play a long time ago. But they can't. They're trapped. And they're trapped because of their greed. Because they kept creating more billions of counterfeit shares. By the time this play is done, there'll probably be trillions of counterfeit shares. I mean, it's absolutely crazy what these bad actors are allowed to get away with. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that these bad actors engage in this level of criminality because they know there will be no repercussions for their actions anyway have a great day god bless and i appreciate y'all on this journey with me